When I was young, I used to be bullied. People called me cruel names. They attacked me verbally and sometimes even physically. But I didn't fight, for I thought they were right. When I turned 12, I badly wanted to be the one being held high in cheerleading, but I ended up being the one carrying. It was fun, yeah, but it would have been more fun. When I turned 13, I started to be more of myself, but sadly, the world isn't that accepting. All the things I thought were okay weren't okay. There were things that I shouldn't do just because it wasn't something a boy would do. When I turned 15, I had my first crush. He was perfect in every way, well, for me. <laughs> he made me blush, he made me smile. He was the reason I was so happy. But the world told me that I'm not supposed to like him, that I'm not supposed to like a boy. That's odd, they say. It made me realize how unfair and sad it is to be different, to be gay, to be me. When I turned 16, I wanted to dress up. I started putting makeup on. I thought it was okay. I thought it's just artistic. But every time I walked past people, they would give me that stare. A stare of disgust, of judgment, of criticism, of disapproval. I should not wear makeup because that's for girls. They made me feel like I was sinful and that I should be embarrassed of myself. Is it really that bad to express your true self? Is it not okay to be different? Is being gay a sin? It was only then I realized that enough is enough. I have to live my life the way I wanted it to be. When I was 18, I started doing makeup videos online. It made me boost my self-confidence. I gained supporters, friends even. I started to embrace who I really am even more. I dressed up, bought my first wig, put makeup on, and I was happy. Genuinely happy. But that's only half the story. Being gay should not always be about how we see ourselves physically. Challenge yourself. It should be more than just a pretty face. Exile in whatever endeavor you choose to pursue. Study. Study very hard. Prove to them that you are more than just your gender. Extend. Use your resources for a greater cause. Join a club. Be a leader. Push yourself to be a better version of yourself. Inspire, be the voice of those who can speak, make wonders, do good, be kind, communicate, be open. We are born different for a reason. We are here because we are important, because we are needed. Like what I always say, our blood is made up of rainbows, so let us live our lives as colorful as it should be. This is Sway Kenyatta. You are valid, you are valued, you are loved. Happy Pride and remember to sway and slay.